have here. Hmm. If you want true power, then slay the four golden beasts that roam the land. Then I shall grant my power to you. So far, you've slain one. Ah, so he must be speaking about the like that that shiny Octorok that we that we saw that we didn't catch because I don't have any Pokeballs in this game. Hmm. So we have three more to get. I wonder what he's gonna give us. What kind of power can this old man possibly possess? What's going on, guys? Merrick here, back with episode 17 of our Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons Let's Play. In the last episode. We uh, beat the Dancing Dragons dungeon. There was no dancing. There was no dragons. And it was a pretty big disappointment. But, what we're going to do now is, since we have that uh, bomb flower, we can take it to the temple. And uh, we can clear away those boulders and stuff that went our way before. And advance to the next area. We kind of did stuff out of order, and I realized that. I try to keep stuff as in order as possible, but I also just like going around and exploring shit. Um, whether I've played a game a thousand times or not. It's just super fun to, to explore stuff, so... Uh, I think I went the wrong way. I think it's this one up here. So I just, I just like going around and doing all the, the cool, fun stuff. Yeah. Oh, that's a bomb flower. Thanks. Okay, let's break it. I like how he runs away and we just stand there like... <laughs> that was great. Now we have plenty thanks to you. If you ever need any ore melted, come to the furnaces. I don't need ore melted. What I do need is my items upgraded. And I don't know where I do that. I thought I did that here in Sobrosia, but I guess not. Uh, this has got to be fall, right? We have, because we have the other three seasons. I don't know what voice to give fall. I am the spirit of autumn. My turn has come. They say fall is lonely, but no. Pits are filled with fallen leaves and mushrooms are ripe for picking. When shadows fall on Hyrule, a hero shall appear. Is that hero you? Then I grant you Autumn's power. I guess technically it's called Autumn, but nobody calls it Autumn. It's Summer, Spring, Winter, Fall. Like, Alright, Autumn Breeze. Now the Rod of Seasons has the powers of all four seasons. This is all the help we can offer you. Oh, I should have been doing that. Of course on you, the blah blah. Din and all holodrome are counting on you. Whoops. <laughs> I thought it was just, you know, still doing the, the explanation thing. Uh, ow, I was pressing the button, the button. There we go. That was, uh, kindly rude. To make me just fall in the lava like that. Alright, so I have the Spirit of Fall. We have collected them all. Hmm. Now what to do? I... I swear, there was... I swear, I thought that we could get our shit upgraded in this freaking Weird, backwards-ass lava planet. Tell me about ore chunks. I know about that. I'm just a manager. Okay, but I don't understand. Why won't you see? That's what. I... Oh, that shit pisses me off. I'm gonna have to look it up. I I'm trying to play this from memory as much as possible, but... 
Like, goddamn, it's just, it's so, it's so grueling, especially with, you know, stupid shit like that, where it's like, I swear I remember this being it, and then that's not it, and that's just, that's just frustrating. Alright, so we're back here now, and if I remember correctly, uh, wait, where's the mystery scene? I had to look this one up, because I remembered this stupid thing, and I didn't remember what it did. Um... And it just, it spawns this little thing, and you just fight this thing, and, and it gives you this little jewel. I don't remember what the jewel is for, but I mean, at some point, we will, uh, we will figure that out. Alright, so it took us, it took us a little while to go ahead and find this fucker, but we have found ourselves the second of the four. God, look how many hits this guy takes. I'm trying to get him out, motherfucker, out, motherfucker, I'm trying to get him stuck in a corner. In a fucking corner, time out. They don't even drop anything, which is, like, really dumb. Like, at least drop me a heart or something, shit. So now that we have the... Hey, stop that. Can I hit him from here? I can't. Fuck off. Ooh, look at that, dodging. Now that we have the Spirit of Autumn, as it's properly called... Uh, we can uh, finally go ahead and get this chest, which has been here since the beginning, obviously. Uh, and we can go ahead and just out, run around here <sighs> for another gosh of seed. Freaking jeez. Like, I wouldn't mind these damn things, but at the same time... So we're trying to reach Eyeglass Lake, which is... Aha, hold on. Nope, I need it here. One of my favorite things about this, about the, the Zelda series is just, ooh, 100 rupees. I bet you're thrilled. Uh, considering I went and used the member's card and bought the seed satchel uh, upgrade and such, yeah, uh, the 100 rupees is actually welcome. Uh, we can no longer go that way, but that's fine. We don't need to go that way. I thought it was summer. Maybe not. I mean, summer definitely got us where we wanted to go as far as getting to the hole in the wall, literally. Ah, uh -huh. okay, so spring is the, the season we needed. Very easy to confuse the two. I mean, hell, there's barely a noticeable difference as far as the coloration for the two. And you never know. Gotta burn that bush, right? So... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to freaking look at the time, you little asshole. Oh, did he de-aggro? Did de huh, I didn't know they would actually de-aggro. Uh, okay. Uh, I think I'm actually supposed... I hate those things. Yeah, I have to change it to fall to be able to get into uh, the next dungeon. And we can't go that way. I want to say there's another thing this way if we change it to summer. So let's go ahead and change it back to summer real quick. And then we'll change it to fall, and we can pick them mushrooms, and get into the next dungeon. On to the fifth dungeon. See, we're actually making more progress here now than in um, Radical Red, and they were kind of caught up, you know, for, for the things and for the thing. Is this where I was supposed to go? Oh, I guess so, because... Huh. Alright, what's in here? Ah, it's the green diglets.
Ow, what the frick? Cool, I got a... I got a piece of a heart, and I lost a heart and a half for, uh... Ah! That's kind of cool, though. Kind of like little Indiana Jones trap. Man, these damn diglets. Alright, well that was exciting. Let's go ahead and go on to the dungeon. <laughs> Oh yeah, I'd love to do the dungeon. Oh, I gotta change it. Why? Get away. Get away. Gotta change the summer to autumn. Hate to break it to you kids, summer is around for a while. Oh look, it's it's maple. It's the syrup witch. I fucked up last time, and I didn't get anything from her that we, we should have. Oh, we, we definitely roped it in here. We need, we really need her to drop that, uh... That vial of whatever it was la that she dropped last time. There's a potion of some kind, and we, we actually needed it for something. But... Up. Is there a heart under every... Ooh. Motherfricker, they respawn. Okay, so there's not a heart under every mushroom. Although there was the first time. Hmm, maybe that's just coincidental. Alright, let's go ahead and start this dungeon, and then... I mean, it's gonna, obviously, we're not gonna finish it in this episode. Unicorn Cave. Of course, uh, yeah. We don't see anything, so there's only two ways to go. Let's go this way first. Hiya, hiya, hiya. Mm, there should be something that drops there. And, uh, nothing. Oh, damn it. Do we at least get those magnetic gloves in this dungeon? Is that why the thing is there? Because I've seen the. We've seen that thing in Sabrosia, but I, I can't do anything about it. Like, I have- we have to have those gloves. And that just led to the beginning. What? Okay. So... This is weird. It's like there's- there's multiple ways to go, but at the same time, there's- there's not. There's two carts there, that's good to know. I hate the flying flower pot flower pots. I guess I can just chuck these down there on those things. Oh, I missed that time. I missed that time. Miss that. <laughs> All right, so our uh, dexterity of throwing. Oh, well, that one. That one should have hit. Maybe we can't hit them. What are we supposed to do with those those guys? All right, let's go ahead and see where this goes, and uh, I'll just. Yeah. See, we can't hit them from the front. I'm guessing they're vulnerable on the back. So I just can't hit them from the. The front or the sides. And that's that fucking magnet shit. Okay, so they don't aggro me. So that's a plus. So I just get behind him. Well, that one I just pushed off the edge, Sparta style. Ow, see, he didn't even turn to touch me. Ow, mother... Stop proving me wrong, asshole. Do, 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 do. Oh, this looks fun. Hug the wall like it's your best friend. 
I mean, this is how I taught myself how to swim. As a child, I just taught myself to hug the freaking... Oh, 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 I don't like this. I just taught myself how to, like, hug the... the pool wall. I found the compass. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I'm just gonna let myself fall, probably. Ah, I almost made the jump. Because, I mean, falling would've just got me right there anyways. <laughs> we pushed that fucker down the hole twice now. Alright, and I can't get over there at all. So I guess they respawn if you push them down the hole, because technically you didn't kill them, they just kind of fell. Oh, there he goes again. Alright, so we need to find these magnetic gloves. Otherwise, we really, there's really not a lot we can do in here. Which, of course, then means that there's, like, other stuff we can go do. Whoops. And especially doing more exploring in Subrosia. Alright, let's do this one first. Ah, they both have switches. Sons of bitches. Alright, so that has a little magnetic thing too, so I really need those goddamn gloves. Ow. Alright, so there's a chest over there. Let's go ahead and I guess we'll hit the switch. And then go up and see where this cart takes us. And then we'll do the same thing with the other the cart on the other side. I mean, I re turn, turn to the side. What the hell is he doing? It's like I was stuck in the animation and I couldn't turn. Okay, so going the other way actually takes you to a chest. But going this way takes you to a completely different room. Interesting. I love how I always try to go the not right way so that I can kind of explore and kind of just make sure I get everything and then it turns out to be the right way to go anyways. See, there's another magnet thing. Oh, man. I wonder if this is where we get the magnets. things are creatures you kill with the boomerang, similar to the weird, uh, the yellow-black sun things. Uh, nope, it just bounces off them. Hmm. Odd. I don't know why, I always have this thing where I just have to break every pot. It's like, I... It, Almost like I, I've got it in my head that there has to be something underneath it. I mean, there were random items and such, but... See, there's one of those those yellow and black things that I was talking about. God damn it, why does it seem like I'm going the right way now? Alright, let's, let's back up for a second. what they do. They just push you around. What the hell? Alright, I got a dungeon map. And that doesn't go anywhere. Okay, so this room's done. Whoa, I almost fell off the edge. It would have made me done, too. Um, so there is a ch Look at all the chests. Holy shit. Okay, so I guess we will go this way since it does not appear that this is the right way to go.
So this more or less led us to the same room. I need a key to get in that door though. Damn it. Okay, so... Mother, I hurt this stupid things. So while that was the right way to go in the way in a way, um, there's also a way that I can't go. I'm not sure what I should do here. Do I put bombs here? I do. Okay. Ow. Why did that hit me? I'm down to four hearts right now. Oh, that was just luck. I remember something about these things not attack you. Oh, I did it the wrong way, didn't I? Shit, I was supposed to push it up. Okay. Let's just go ahead and... <sighs> Damn, I, I really need to wrap this episode up, but... Alright, so we got some hearts back. Can I... Can I at least get... Done with whatever here I need to do? Before I move on, that way I don't have to do so much again. There's just the chest. Good. Let's go that way, and then let's go up top. 100 rupees. I'll take it. I don't really need it, but I'll take it. Who knows? I, I, I was pretty sure that upgrading your stuff was in Subversia, and that, that required a horn, but maybe it's not. And so having, having rupees, having a bunch of rupees will actually be beneficial to us uh, being able to finally upgrade our gear. There's Kepora. Um, that looks like that leads into <laughs> into a boss room, or like a mini boss, and I don't don't feel like dealing with that yet. Uh, let's see what he has to say. Recall the order you slay the knights in. So you have to kill them in a certain order, I guess. Okay. I was thinking it had to do with the shit in the other room. Wow, okay. That did not leave us in a good position. Uh, let's go ahead and just wrap it up here, and I'll just, I'll... I'm gonna do the next one anyway, so we may as well just stay right here, and I'll... Go ahead and do it from this spot here, so... 
if you guys are enjoying the series, hit that like button down below for us. Let us know any more unusual games, any more Zelda games you might want to see, any older games, etc. I got plenty of stuff planned for the future coming up, and uh, I know I keep making plans, and life keeps shitting on me and taking away my time. But hopefully, hopefully, we can uh, start to pick back up the way I want to. Uh, always remember to save your game because if you lose that data, it would be a shame. And we're going to go ahead and get the frig out of here now. And so we'll see you guys in the next episode.